Nikki Bernstein here with trainer Wesley Ward and Undrafted who will be sent out this Saturday in the Grade 3 Swale Stakes. He enters this race after finishing third in the Grade 3 Hutchison on February 2nd, uh, but always running in the money. He took six months off last June and returned with a win on December 1st. Why such a long layoff? Um, you know, he'd been in training quite a while, and he, he ran a, a, a very big race when he broke his maiden there at Keeneland. And we were intending on bringing him over to England to Royal Ascot, but uh, the conditions over there were just... Uh, pretty soggy. It was raining quite a bit. So we scratched that and I sent him out to Hollywood Park and uh, he ran a credible third in the first stake out there. And by, when he got back, he just sort of was, I think he'd been in training for so long and he was kind of off of his feed that we decided to go ahead and just turn him out and give him a break. No physical issues, just, just you know, let him come back into himself. And, and when we picked him up in the fall, he uh, he's just trained forwardly and done everything right and hasn't missed a note and hasn't missed a day of training. He's doing great. Wonderful. Now he's shown a lot of versatility uh, with a lot of running on a lot of different surfaces. First couple races he ran on the synthetic, then ran on the turf. Why did you decide to run him back on the dirt? Uh, well, he's bred for the grass, so that's the reason why when I brought him back, I put him on the turf. But he's trained so well. Every work he's had here at Gulfstream, he just he just really works well over the main track. Um, I was a little disappointed in his Gulfstream Park Derby performance although the horses that came out of it are, are very good horses so um, sort of validated that that you know he did run very good that day and it was a very very fast opening half in 44 and change so he did come back though to to run very 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 good in the Hutchison so that's why you know, I think he'd be spot on here for Saturday. Now he drew the inside post uh, he'll battle some speed in this race how would you like to see the race unfold? Well, you know, drawing the one hole is always a problem. Um, you know, that's kind of the kiss of death. So that that's going to be, a, you know, a little bit of a, you know, first eighth of a mile out of the race if you see how he does. But, uh, you know, and, and I don't know if we'll, we'll have to, you know, go from the one hole or if we'll take back. We'll have to see how it plays out on the day and how the, how the track is playing. He's owned by wide receiver of the New England Patriots, Wes Walker. Can you tell us what it's like working together and how many horses he currently has with you? He's... Um, He's a great guy. He uh, he's super owner. Uh, loves the game. Comes out and sees all the races and watches all the races and uh, and and he's really into it. So it's nice to see you know a guy you know uh, that prominent sports figure be be involved in, in racing. And, and he's also very lucky. He's he's got had a lot of luck in the game, which is which is good. I mean, everyone he seems to jump into is a runner. So he's got the. Uh, He's got the Midas touch there. Racing fever, maybe. Mm -hmm, yeah. Does he? How many does he have with you? Is this the only one, or does he have more? No, he's, he has five. But he's had a, a, a number of horses in the past. He's had a lot of success. He's had uh, multiple stakes winners, and and um, you know, which is great for the game. And I, I hope we bring more of his buddies in. Wonderful. Well, we can't wait to see Wesley Ward this Saturday send out Undrafted, who looks like he is ready to go for the Grade Three Swale Stakes.